This is the video where I present my funded companies portfolio, basically how I am funded with over, I think six or seven platforms. I will go over each of them. All right, everyone, Andrew here with a new YouTube video. This has been requested past a few weeks. So here it is. This is the video where I present my funded companies portfolio, basically how I am funded with over, I think six or seven platforms. I will go over each of them, my capital, my experience with them coming from a non-bias, uh, basically experience Experience because I am a trader so I use these platforms to actually make money I am not affiliated with any company so it's just gonna be my personal opinion if uh, a company doesn't like what I say then uh, I guess I'll just take it in I'm used to getting banned as you probably know but I want to present and go over because I've been receiving many comments many DMs asking me about platforms that I use or that I recommend again this video I will not recommend any platforms because I know how they behave so I do not recommend any platform specifically I will just go over my portfolio what I use how much money around I've withdrawn from every platform and uh, my experience with them. So let's get into it and uh, see what platforms I use. All right, so obviously one of the first platforms that I used was my Forex funds. It was the first funding company that I basically got max funded. I got 600k to 300k accounts. And I also hit uh, the three months mark and got the VIP program on both of the accounts. So those two accounts were basically the biggest uh, asset that I had because you could withdraw every single day. The profit split was, uh, I think, 85% or 90%. Can't even remember. But uh, that was the first platform company that I actually recommended to my students and uh, a lot of people because it was the, basically we thought it was the most safe. Obviously, uh, that wasn't the case. But after that, basically my portfolio right now stands. I'm around $4.1 million in funding. So I went to 5.5 was my max. I came down to like 2.5 because I got banned on multiple platforms. I had a losing streak, lost some funded accounts, and now a few months later, I'm back above the 4 million mark and slowly building towards 5 million. So I'm gonna say what platforms I wanna use to basically get that max funding. So right now, the platforms that I use in terms of capital, so starting from the highest, the highest capital I have at the moment is Funded Engineer. So I have been trading with Funded Engineer for almost four months now, I think. Uh, I got their max account, which was was 500k so that was the account i went for i used it i withdrew around 78k right now that's my lifetime payouts and i'm also the first trader at their company to hit the scaling plan on a 500k account so the account is right now at 625 thousand because i got that 30 percent increase i think i have a 90 percent profit split i have same day payouts and just wanted to give you my experience working with them so so far uh i can say it's the only platform again not affiliated with anything uh, first platform that actually cares about traders one of them uh because first of all i had no manipulation issues no spread issues nothing like that so you can clearly see when you're trading on a platform or on a broker that manipulates price and one broker who doesn't you're going to be more profitable on the one that doesn't but uh, uh, because we're so used to manipulation you don't really see the difference but i can tell you there is a difference so i really enjoyed the the fact that they don't have any plugins nothing like that nothing crazy no issues whatsoever with spread slippage nothing like that i've just been able to consistently trade and withdraw and as i said i'm the first one to hit the skin plan on the 500k account and um, yeah my experience with them has been great so far hopefully i'm gonna hit the six month mark scale the account more now i'm just focusing on basically using that account to take scalp trades so our intraday trading, secure some profits, withdraw it at the end of the day. The way I do it with the same day withdrawal is basically if you withdraw the profits after, let's say, New York close until London morning session, you're going to have the account reset and your money on the way. So that's a very good way to make money if you can hit the scaling plan. Now, second company that I am uh, basically the highest capital is the Fundy Trader, which I'm currently at 600k. I'm going to get a 25% increase very soon, I think after tomorrow's payout, um, basically. Basically, that's gonna be 600k plus 25%. That's gonna be 750 thousand dollars. So that's gonna be basically the highest capital. So I'm looking forward toward that. Uh, now the funny trader again, not non-biased opinion. They are great in terms of payouts, but I don't really enjoy their broker. I think they have plugins and slippage and all of that. I've experienced a lot of slippage uh, positions when I'm entering. I'm always getting uh, basically executed at a very quite big difference on your USD. So one pip on the end one to two pips on stop loss which again uh it's something we have to do, deal with so the way i've been trading that account is just mostly using bigger stop losses and lower lots and just letting trade run and uh, yeah i've withdrew from tft more than 100k i'm pretty sure i have a 20k payout coming basically
basically tomorrow after this video is recorded so hopefully that goes through and then i can also keep the scaling plan and the king's program and that's gonna be another good asset that i have but otherwise payouts um, they have been delayed quite a lot but overall it's quite a safe company but you need to respect their rules because they have a lot of rules and you need to be very careful about slippage otherwise it's a pretty good company it's a big company so don't expect any too fishy stuff happening like them uh, closing down or something now the next company i'm funded at is funding pips which is actually a great company actually i recently had my interview with them it should be posted maybe when this video gets out uh, it's gonna be out as well the interview no issues with them i think their broker is quite different because they use blackpool at the moment so no slippage no manipulation nothing like that spread is very good commission is very good you can easily trade that platform and make money payouts have been on time always you can withdraw every seven days which is a big plus so basically for me every friday i request my withdrawal until tuesday my account is reset and i can trade uh, again and then basically after five trading days i think you can also request a new payout so so far no issues with them also met their ceo and it was quite nice so that's uh, the one i use so 300k i have on funding pips so far building uh bringing my total capital to around so i said 600,000 on tft plus 625 on the funding engineer plus 300k which is basically funding pips my total capital so far is 1.5 next company that i have is uh of course true forex funds so true forex funds has been around for quite a while i think it was after ftmo launched i have been trading with them i have lost some funding accounts never really hit the scaling plan and anything like that now i'm planning on hitting it uh, because i'm doing a more conservative basically trading approach to the live accounts so true forex funds i'm currently funded 400k so two uh, 200k accounts my experience with them is they're a bit expensive i use them on my company behalf so you can have the vat uh, deduct so you're gonna pay less for the challenge um yeah it's one of the most expensive challenge the targets are normal eight percent five percent uh, they have one of the best spreads in the platform industry but they have a high commission so keep in mind of that it's very similar to ic market so you've been trading uh, live account ic markets you can use my uh, my link below to register on ic markets if you want i've been trading with them for quite a while multiple six figures payouts and all of that yeah it's quite it's quite all right it's a very safe platform that you can go to they don't really have discounts but it's a safe approach payouts have been quite long because they reset the account that's what i don't like because from the payout date you have to wait like let's say three four days until your payout gets approved and your account reset so that's the thing i don't really like hopefully they're gonna improve that but otherwise i use that account to again take some swing trades some trades that i let run because of the commission uh, and all of that is not really worth it to take scalp trades so that brings my total now to 1.925 million dollars in funding capital let's move on next one i have is 300k at my funded fx so i've been trading with my funded fx since they launched uh very good experience overall i i think i am uh, basically over the 100k mark right now so i've uh, withdrew more than 100k i did lose quite a few challenges but i'm over very very profitable with their platform no issues so far they are great uh, payouts are always it's one of the i think few platforms that actually when you withdraw your payouts it resets the account immediately so you can start trading again payouts every two weeks profit split is uh, i think 80 percent base payout they process them quite fast crypto and all of that so no issues with that uh, it's a very good company to go through they have uh, a lot of promos so that brings my total now to 2.2 million dollars basically now next company is uh basically funding next so funding next i did have some bad experience with them when i uh, first got funded so i got funded with them i think two months ago or something like that two and a half months ago i've been trading with them i did get around 20 something k in payouts i did hit their also five percent target because they give you 15 percent bonus from phase one and phase two when you hit uh five percent overall basically profit on the live account so that was a nice bonus because it was around 3k so i'll take that any day uh, which is great however when i first got the funded account my slippage was extremely bad i took a position i, I still remember 10 lots uh on um, euro usd and it basically put me three pips in drawdown and then when price went to break even basically three po three uh, pips up let's say and i closed it i got slipped three pips more so i still lost and that was unacceptable i however i did write them a support email showing the evidence and they basically f uh, fixed the slippage for me and they also returned me the money 
so there is no issues with that since then i've been very profitable on their prop from no fish stuff uh, i'm about to do an interview with them also so i have 200k accounts uh, a 200k account with them also so that brings my total to 2.4 million dollars next funding company is alpha capital group that i use again i had some issues with them but that was due to uh, again i had some issues with them but that was due to my mistake so they're the it's a platform that basically has no commission on trades which i find great their spread is all right no slippage nothing like that uh payouts are on time all, always their support team is very good i did have some issues where i went above the lot size limit and one of my fund account got uh, got basically cancelled uh, but i they still paid me 25 percent of the profits that i was owed but unfortunately because i did go over that lot size limit without me knowing uh basically got the fund account disabled but that's uh, no problem because I got funded again. So no issues with them. You need to respect the rules. They're very, very um, careful about the rules because if you do not respect them, obviously they're gonna uh, not ban you, but basically disable your fund account. So that brings my total to 2.6 million. Now, another company I'm funded with is uh, basically FXFY dot com that's the company uh which i was funded before but i lost my final account unfortunately they're one of the few platforms that actually offer a 400k account so i have i actually just got funded recently 400k account i did get buy some add-ons so want to say about them they are pretty expensive especially if you get some add-ons so i think the 400k challenge with 90 percent profit split and also bi-weekly payouts was around 2.5k dollars which is a lot right um, but if you they do run some promo sometimes so i did get a promo the thing i like about them is that the first payout on the funding account is basically same day uh, so you can withdraw at any time you want the challenge is 10 percent target and 5 percent target which is a bit tough their broker is quite right if you go for the no commission one you do have a bigger spread but no slippage no commission so that's very good i didn't have any problems with ex execution and um, yeah basically first payout you can make 1k 500 dollars and request it get the refund for the challenge and then start trading on a bi-weekly basis no issues with them with any payout before i'm sure i'm not gonna have any issues and hopefully i will hit the scaling plan in the next three months with them also next one is union wealth management which i have an interview with uh, you can search it up i have 300k i did have two 300k accounts unfortunately i lost one because again my personal bias they do have some weird rules that's not really written so the thing is with their drawdown they have a weird drawdown i didn't really understand it but on the standard account which is not the swing one your max drawdown so the 10 percent goes up with every payout let's say for me i made around 12 to 13k profits on the account and my equity went up my max equity stop at uh, 10 percent went up also so now it's not 10 percent; it's around eight percent so that means if you keep making profits on the live account at some point you're gonna have lower and lower overall drawdown and at some point you're gonna lose the final account which i thought i find it very weird uh, and i've asked them to basically switch me to a regular based drawdown so i'll see how that happens because that's just the rule that at some point you're gonna blow your account because you don't have a lot of margin to risk but in terms of payouts and customer service and all of that no issues whatsoever i've got paid i think it's it's the fastest payouts i have ever gotten crypto uh, account reset and all of that so no issues with them also that brings my total to basically 400k i didn't put it plus 300k brings my total to 3.3 million dollars now next platform is skilled funded trader which uh, did have some bad experience bad luck with them not bad experience uh, their support team is very good their owners i've met them met omar riz they're very nice guys so no issues with that i was just very unlucky on their problems to be honest i've lost quite a few challenges with them when i got funded with the the challenge that has a lower drawdown i forgot about that and lost my funded account so i've been max funded before now i got max funded again 400k on the standard challenge and unfortunately i'm again in a bit of a drawdown so i'm down around 4.5 percent when all my other accounts were in big profits it just happened uh, i got a back bad trades on those accounts so i didn't really secure any payouts yet from their platform but hopefully i'm gonna turn the funding accounts around and get some payouts but again no issues with them um they really care about traders so that's all right that's plus 400k which brings my total to 3.7 million now one more company uh two more companies no actually three more companies 
I'm just gonna go over them quickly. Uh, each of them is 200k. So I have Glow Node funding, which is a very new company. No issues with payouts. Uh, actually, the payouts was a bit long. I think I waited around four to five days for the payout to get approved, but it did get approved, so no issues with that. Um, hopefully, the next one is also gonna be approved quite fast. But they pay via crypto. You know, it's a new company when they don't really have a fast process, but I think they they can improve a lot more. Second one is Lark funding, which I have 200k at which I'm due for my payout and refund because it was after 30 days. So hopefully I will basically see if they pay out. Can't really say my opinion with them at the moment. And the last one is Bright Funded. Uh, which is also a very new company that I like because they have their own platform, platform, their own app and everything. They have a very different style. They're a new company, so there's a lot of room to grow. And um, yeah, basically I'm expecting a payout. I've also been very unlucky with them, quite, lost quite a few money on challenges. Uh, this payout that I'm expected to also come after 30 days, uh, which is not quite good one month. So wait for the first payout, should cover most of those fees and then the next one should bring me profits. But their broker is very, very nice. Their app is very, very nice. It, and it's just something uh, different. So basically that brings my total to 4.3 million dollars. Now, one more company that I want to talk about, which I was funded with and I'm looking to get funded again again is basically blue guardian uh, which is also no issues with them i had a lot of payouts a broker was all right the only thing i didn't like is the four percent daily drawdown which is not five percent but you have ten percent overall which again had no issues with payouts nothing like that just been unlucky with some trades it happens with funding accounts but hopefully i'll get funded again and basically with that uh, plus 400k i'm gonna get to 4.5 million dollars so 4.5 million dollars and then try some new uh, more platforms and get to that 5.5 million mark again so that's my goal for the end of the year and from there focus on one to two percent profit every single month so just my last opinion because this was a very long video going over all my portfolio i hope it's going to be valuable these platforms i had are the only ones i didn't have issues with in terms of payouts and everything i did get funded to more companies so i was back around 5 million well, i've tried new companies don't really want to name them but after basically passing the challenges and all of that they denied me the funding account um, they said i'm a risk and all of that so i couldn't get funded uh, which was a waste of time that's the thing again i'm not recommending any prop firms because prop firms mainly make money from losing challenges so if 95% 96% of people lose challenges basically these platforms feed of the fees that they get and they basically pay out the winners but it's still a good way to make some money as you saw from my videos I've been funded for two years now training funding companies and I've made quite a lot of money quite a lot of money but I've just been focusing on the long-term planning so not trying to secure a big payout um, I think my biggest payout is gonna be now from TFT which is around 20k so not a lot of money compared to the results that I've seen but it's very important to have consistent payouts every single payout cycle secure those payouts invest to more funding and basically grow from there so that's it for this video guys if you have any more questions about any platform that i use and all of that you can leave a comment down below hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe and like it and i will go very hard on this youtube channel to provide as much value as i can because i'm one of the few traders that actually made it in the funding basically sphere started to make money and slowly going into the private capital so i think i can share some good experience for you guys so thank you for 